I'm a member of Sieku village and also a committee member to meet in Mali, women to Yaboreta. Uh, here I am to tell you the benefits that we are going to incur. Uh, the first one is we will be having enough water as a village and also as a community, in me, including me as a person. Another one is we will be having people will be employed, both youth and also our elders, especially the ones who will be selecting the, the indigenous trees. The ones we as youth we cannot incur them because of some challenges. Maybe we have never seen them before. They are not in the area anymore. It will be also an historical site whereby we will preserve our culture here. It will also be a uh, tourist attraction site whereby so many people from outside and also within will be looking at as, a Sambu as Samburus we are supposed to be at least having these trees before but now that it has been it has been so hard to have them because of maybe drought so many of them Many of our trees are not now here, and we cannot even tell them where they are. Not unless we just have our elders to help us in that. Uh, it will also be cost-saving. The people will be looking, especially during the cultural times and beliefs, when we are going to take ceremonies. So many of these trees will not be available because for now it will be a cost. It will be so costly to walk from here, Kipsing, to another area to find a tree. Just because of a ceremony, it will. It is so 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 hard to find them. So we also thank for that. And another thing, it will be also a learning site whereby our students, our incoming children, will learn from it. They will be so so and so privileged to have them. 